Hello there. I'm Justin Rose, and this is my Pecha Kucha project. And the topic I'm going to be discussing is coping with depression. It's a fairly personal topic, but I think it's a great uh, topic to discuss and allow me to share and open up. Depression doesn't discriminate. It doesn't matter who you are, your level of success, or where you live. We all feel it sometimes, but others like me who suffer from chronic depression, it is a daily struggle. This is me. I'm like a lot of people. I had a nice upbringing in a small town. I had friends and I did well in school. But there was always something inside that made me feel sad and made me feel a little different. A lot of people, probably mostly all people, feel sad and blue at times. But for me, it's genetic. I have numerous family members that also have issues with depression. So knowing that is useful. Depression gives you that feeling like everything's barren and there's not a lot of life. These trees show winter is here and that's what depression feels like. All winter is always here. Depression can have a negative impact in many ways. An attempt to cope, sufferers can turn to a variety of things. For me, I found that I self-medicated through alcohol and this alienated myself from friends and everyone who I loved. I also found escape in gambling. Gambling allowed my mind to shut off and live in the here and now. But many times, especially if I lost a significant amount, it only exacerbated those feelings of depression and the cycle would just go on and on. And when all that self-medicating and escape tactics didn't work, I'd find myself sleeping all day, I'd always feel tired, and I'd lay on the couch and watch endless hours of TV just to avoid facing the world and my depression. And even with this daily struggle, I know that a better road is ahead. Even though that road may be cutting through a desert today, if I keep driving, I know that I'll find a blooming landscape up ahead. The challenge is not to give in to those negative escapes, but to find ways to cope and deal with the ongoing depression. And there are a number of ways to assist in this search for a better road. You know, I have found medication is extremely useful in maintaining a good balance and keeping those lows from getting too low. I've also found exercise is a great way to feel better. When I exercise regularly, I have more energy, my overall spirits are up. And right now I'm training for a, a big race and that keeps me focused on something other than my, my depression. Another great method to reduce that feeling of depression is to meditate. Taking time each morning to center myself and just take a few minutes to relax, breathe deeply, and start my day is a great way to reduce my depression for the day. And another avenue to take is to find some to take therapy. Therapy is a great resource. It allows you to talk about uh, things that are going on. It's not for everybody. I've had mixed results, but it works for a lot of people, and it's a great option. Making time to spend time with friends is really, really important as well. It's so easy when you're depressed to kind of hide away and shut yourself off from the world, but finding time for friends is a great benefit. Hobbies are also a great way 
uh, to uh, cope with depression. One of the things I do, I play guitar. I've been doing this for many years. I found that it helps to stress. I've also found writing songs helps me express myself. That helps reduce my overall depression. I also found uh, doing art is a great way uh, to just relax and take my mind off of things in a positive way. I, I paint and I draw. I try to take some time a few times each week to sit down and, and sketch. Just another great hobby. The one thing I always have to remember though is that the depression will always be there. The potential to have that those kind of episodes will be there. And just recognizing that and not allowing it to dominate my life is the best way I've found to cope with it. And even though some days will still feel a little down and it's hard to kind of get up for the day, one thing is the sun does come through the clouds and happiness is just around the corner. And blue skies are on the horizon even though at times things look like a desert in front of us. The biggest thing is just to keep moving forward towards those blue skies and that horizon and life has great potential. Thank you for coming on this journey with me and this presentation. It's been a great opportunity to discuss this topic that's so close to my heart. Been the great thing is uh, the, rain, the rainbow comes through the clouds and the day is bright. Thanks again.